is in her blood, but her motive for running was slightly different. There was no one else to run. If they get somebody in off the street, <laughs> I'm going to have to train them anyway, <laughs> so I might as well <laughs> just do it. County For Dixon, the transition was pretty easy. Updating minor processes around the office was a start. When I came in as clerk and recorder, there was just a couple. We got a credit card machine. There's just a little bit things of coming to with the generation that we are in. Dependent on the county, some clerk and recorders wear many hats from budget, HR, and payroll. Meet Paula Giaconetti. I felt so un. Um, welcomed. Teton County Clerk and Recorder. Two decades in the business, Paula ran against both a Republican and a Democrat. Her first days in the office were not what she imagined. I went home after two weeks crying, telling my husband, oh, what have I done? Paula was on a mission, a mission to grow the morale of a staff that was unreceptive to the new boss. I learned it as I went, but I dig into things and I'm not afraid to ask questions or to figure out how to do it. The job isn't for the faint of heart. It takes courage, social skills, and most importantly, integrity. Integrity is important because everything you do affects everybody in the county, not just yourself. Because there's not a job description written down when you, there's your requirements by law to do, but that's pretty much it. Paula is gearing up for retirement. She's working on plans to ensure that her successor can beat the learning curve. Iffy, iffy. I've got written directives on what needs to be done on certain months. If they walked in right now, there would be a learning curve for them, but it would not be an impossible learning curve for them to follow. Upon a new office holder, Jack and Eddie can be hired as a temporary employee to mentor during a new budget cycle, payroll, or whatever else the new officer needs. That's overwhelming to somebody coming in, even if they have a background. So I would be there. I'd be available for them. In the words of Henry Ford, coming together is a beginning. Staying together is progress. Working together is success. And there's no doubt the world needs more harmony. In North Central Montana, Ryan Gamboa, MTN News.